House point totals are being calculated. Ooh, who's going to be this time? I'll give you three guesses. But I've got this feeling. It's a hunch. It is a hunch. But it might just be me. Ravenclaw. Oh, sorry, I mean Gryffindor. Although it actually pretty much is me. I'm the only one who's bothering getting the points. Which is very weird. Especially Hermione. I think she'd be drowning in points. But no. Probably be in minus if it wasn't for me. Gryffindor. I might actually be watching the points. I've actually been looking around in my room for some reason. I've got a lot of stuff to move around in my room. Gryffindor, I think we've won though. <laughs> Gryffindor yes. is in the lead. Never in doubt. We had just won the Quidditch Cup. It'd be nice to get the full set. Alright then, it's time for the last night mission. With a tear to my eye almost. <laughs> so many happy memories of just staying awake to the long hours of the night. <laughs> oh dear. Where well, where's one being? Probably we've been battling the I evil fairies of Asgore office. for and then having I had to go to see yeah, a bit more realistic. What? Hermione? McGonagall told me that Ginny's gone missing. They can't find her anywhere. Oh, oh no! no! When it gets dun, worse, dun, dun. Hermione. No sound effect this time, I'm afraid. She's been petrified. Oh, huh? Top it all up. It's like I paranormal activity like around here. Outside moaning myrtles. Steph is aboard. McGonagall told me that they were doing everything they could to find Ginny. So, I went to see Hermione. Oh, of course. Go to the woman who's petrified. Hand. I'm sure you'll a get a lot out of her. From an <laughs> Oh, actually, he that did. What do you know? Whoa! Move over, Sherlock Holmes. Here comes Harry Potter, Mr. Detective. The giant snakes that live for hundreds of years. Apparently, a basilisk can kill people by just staring at them. Is that a copy off Medusa Anything at all? Else? I don't know. <laughs> and then that sounds yeah, stone, doesn't it? I'm sort like of killing them anyway. They run away when a basilisk is near. And there was something else. Hermione had written the word pipes on the page. Page probably from the photo of Brutal, by the sounds of it. <laughs> Pipes. That's Probably gets filed pipes. under major plot spoilers. Wrong. Pipes. Sounds like something it. a piercing or sex toy, probably. The monster in the chamber of secrets is a basilisk, a giant snake. Yes, Harry, we've just been told what a basilisk is. You haven't got to tell us again. It's because I understand parcel tongue. Oh dear, Harry, it's all getting unveiled Ginny now, isn't it? In the chamber of secrets, along with that flipping big snake. McGonagall said they searched everywhere in the castle, but no one knows where the chamber is. We've got to find her. That means I've got to okay, go and rescue her. So what we need to know is how the basilisk been getting round the place. A giant snake. Surely someone would have seen <laughs> Moves it. Moves the dramatic cam camera angle. Pipes! Pipes, Ron! It's been using the plumbing! Of course! I've been hearing the voice inside oh, makes the walls. sense! As much as Harry Potter never makes sense. The entrance to the Chamber of Secrets. What if it's a bathroom? What if it's in Moaning Myrtle's bathroom? <gasps> Gulping gargoyles! Okay. So what do we do? The place is crawling with prefects looking for Ginny. I'll go first. You join me in moaning myrtles on the second floor. And so Ron just walks straight out. Yep, Ron, you really listen to me, don't you? <laughs> yeah. But yeah. Thanks very much for getting the Gadding with Ghouls book, Harry. Here's a Have wizard, a wizard card. card. No worries, I've got everything else this year. If I'd kept this all, I could have made a fortune on eBay with loads of Harry Potter goods. Um, what's the last one? Oh, that's the second to last, I think. Could be anywhere. About as helpful as the last one. Um, let's see. Is there any point going to Fred and George's? Because I really don't think there is. But I'm going to go to anyway, because, I don't know. Let's see what I can get now. This night mission may be too long, I don't think. I mean, if my mind serves me correctly, we've just got to go to the chamber, go down, then beat the basilisk, and then that's it. Amongst a load of cutscenes. Oh, and get the night the um, notice board thing from outside as well. But aside from that, there's really not that much to do in this one compared to the last part, which was like 30 minutes long. I think it's going to be like a 20 minute. A 20 huh? minute epic. Oh god. Liberty Jibbit. Hurry up. I must be hearing things. Get through the portrait. There we go. I had no doubt, really. Anything here that I can buy that'd be interesting. Oh, card. How much is an egg a stronger card? 30 Bertie box every flavour beans. The limited edition Bertie Bot card. What does that cost? 
30, 30 bots, <laughs> every flavor of beans. All of them. Um, actually, I don't want to wait to the end, because I think you can actually find half the cards um, without having to buy them. I might be wrong, but you never know. Come here! Oh no! Locomotor Mortis! <laughs> Very fast for a prefect. How embarrassing for Percy. Right, well, I'm sure you'll agree that it was a complete waste of time, but. Mal well. <laughs> Let's just get on with it. Go save the world. Of course, Harry's a veteran at that now, isn't he, really? Down we go. Out to the grounds first, of course. To be honest, I still don't understand really why they have um, no prefects on the staircase. I mean, it made the game a whole lot harder. I'm sort of grateful that they don't, but it makes it a lot more interesting. They have ghosts, I suppose, but they don't do much to deter you. But no one else, everyone else seems to obey the rules, though, to be honest. So it seems to be Harry, who just, who just roams the place like his royalty. Shock to you, Harry, but just because your parents died doesn't mean you're a royalty. Otherwise, you'd have loads of people claim to be queen, king and queen in our country. That'd be hilarious. Yeah, this is pretty much standard now, isn't it? Business as usual, sort of thing. Easy to get past. Run really close to them now, and everything. They still don't hear you. No, oh, it's so silly. Well, this one, thankfully, is relatively easy. It can take you an age to find, because they give absolutely no helpful clues at all, but it is really quite easy, so that helps. Cheeky peek around the wall to see where another guy is coming. There you go. God, surely you'd hear that. I'm sorry, but they, they clearly, if I'd invest in Hogwarts at all, I'd get the teachers a bunch of hearing aids. Honestly, it's somewhere along here. Not sure how far along it is, but it's definitely along here. There we go. Brilliant. Nice pink book. Stands out a little bit, which is good. Now I'm just going to get back. Shouldn't be too tricky. That's the best triangle there, because I thought Lumos would be on there, but no incendio. I'd rather not set a prefect on fire. Can be an interesting way to spend an evening. He just stayed there at the end again, as usual. There he's off down there. Awesome. Easiest part. Skillage in the village, indeed. Nothing around here. No, it's just hide behind here. <laughs> Spot the wizard. Oh, glitch much. See into the wall. Bollocks, I can't get seen. I spent too long playing around there. Hey, oh. you! No, never in doubt. I'm just gonna randomly get a bean because I feel like it. Because I'm a bloke. <laughs> now, second floor, yeah, yes, I, I do remember where the bathroom is. <laughs> It'd be pretty embarrassing if I didn't remember where one of the key components of the game is. I love how they had like that little witch sign there. And where like nobody just like like that at all. You don't see anyone wearing the hats in the game, but they have to buy the stuff like the first year. Oh, that's crazy. Oh, it's you, Harry Potter. What do you want this time? To ask how you died. Well, it's like Piers Morgan's life stories. Oh, it was dreadful. It happened right here. Ooh, I did creepy, creepy. Because Olive Hornby was teasing me about my glasses. I was Believe crying me, was not the worst when part I about heard you, someone <laughs> come in. It was a boy, and he began speaking with a different language. I was on the phone. to go to use his own bathroom. I'll pass all time for him. But how? <laughs> I love how Harry's just shouting here. But how? 
Tell me more about this game's plot, because I've just got buckled by it. Over there, by the sinks. Harry, say something! Something in parcel tongue! What? Go on, Harry. Okay, then. Come on, here's a new one. Open up! English? Come on, Harry, try harder than that. You are second year, after all. I've got to get me one of these things. I'd keep so much stuff down that hole. Be a great security device. I'm going down there! Just imagine buying it and people being like, Oh! Well, can anyone actually speak parcel tongue? Harry just dives down their feet first, ever the adventurer. And then Ron's just like, Okay then, I'll, uh, I'll wait here and keep an eye on the bathroom. Yes, I'll keep an eye on the bathroom. You go ahead, Harry! And here we are. Grand old chamber of secrets. Lovely place. Ginny? Automatic pose. She won't wake. She's still alive, but only just. Dun, dun, dun. Tom? Tom Riddle? You've got to help me, Tom. We've got to get her out of here. She's like a very sort of like a big hair whips. Like she's alive. S sweeps the hair, but only just. Let me tell you about the real reason Ginny's like this. She's been writing in the diary. My diary for months. I grew stronger and stronger on a diet of her deepest fears until I had enough power so that's to that's what start you need to feed people with diet deepest fears for dead people. What do you mean? Works wonders. Ginny Weasley opened the Chamber of Secrets. No! She daubed threatening messages on the walls and set the Serpent of Slytherin on the mudblood of the nearly many, headless many, Nick. Many, many times. No! I'm afraid so. <laughs> Ginny Not so me good little Ginny anymore, isn't she? So I decided to show you my famous capture of that great oaf Hagrid to <gasps> gain your trust. He's not a... You framed oaf. Hagrid! He's yes, great, but he's but not an oaf. Harry Potter, how is it that you Hagrid. managed to defeat been the framed. greatest wizard of all time? There's Harry Hill watching what a clip of that. What do you care? Haven't you realised yet? I am Lord Voldemort, the greatest sorcerer in the world! Bit, bit, Sorry bit living to disappoint you in the old one. that, <laughs> but the greatest sorcerer in the world is Albus Dumbledore. Dumbledore's been driven out of Hogwarts by the mere memory of me. Beware the bird! He's not as gone as you Big might think! bird, beware! To business, Harry. I'm going to teach you a little lesson. Let's match the powers of Lord Voldemort, heir of Salazar Slytherin, against the famous Harry Potter. Who actually killed you once before, so... I'll do it again! Oh my god, it's huge! Get a load of Tom Riddle's serpent! Go, Pidgey! Pidgey! Use sand attack! Use tackle! Use blind! Use everything you've got! So my boy is a silly sword. Oh god, I'm gonna get killed by the snake. He does like a weird jump with like that's about. Die, Harry Potter! I'm just gonna try and kill him. Just run straight through him. Well, a third of being paper thin, that's just taking it to a whole new level. Kill him. Oh, there it is. No! Come on, you should be saying, let me just let me do my business. No! We just a boss fight, it's just. He had to sort of go for his neck. <laughs> Over the bed. Oh. Where's it gone? There it is. Kill him! No! Die! Just going to sleep, alright. Give me a fire jump. This thing is bloody huge. Quite intimidating as well, Snitty coming out. Still smell him. Kill him. I quite like snakes to actually myself, so I'm like this one. Kill the oh, one. Okay, so I'm It's, it's a lot easier than it takes a lot less time than the PS1 though, there's no doubt about that. That 
goes on for quite a bit of time. Die, Harry Potter! Sword, sword. There he is. There it is. Oh, kill him! I love how Tom Williams says, kill him, kill him! Thanks, just completely unresponsive. Kill him. Pardon me, it actually feels like it. Oh, there it is. Hello, beastie! <laughs> Cheers. Gosh, you must be a soul of a party. I don't even know what sort of move that is, really, does it? It's sort of like. Oh, Shit, actually, I should probably use my soul saving potion. Might come in handy because I'm probably going to get hit again. I keep getting hit by his. this. this the big green jaws. And... I don't know. <laughs> probably better if I. Oh my god, he's. Oh, he's a giant snake. <laughs> I'd like some sort of thing to pop by. Gee, don't die yet, please. Just give me a minute, alright, and I'll sort everything out. I'll make it all brand new. I even give you a box of chocolate for this one. I don't know what I'm about to do, I just want to kill this one. Make it. Should be it. Come on, spray. Oh. Lightning move! And by amazing coincidence, straight down onto. Kid, I'm reading a book. Don't you ever get out of I'm reading a book. That's why you should read books. Or, or, no, or always carry a book around with you, because a snake might just fall onto it and kill a dark lord. Obviously. Harry, oh Harry, I wanted to tell you. It was me, Harry. But I swear I didn't mean to. Riddle made me do it. It's alright. Riddle's finished. Come on, Ginny. Let's get out of here. No, it's not alright. She's almost. almost killed several students and everything. Oh dear. I want to see Jenny. Challenge complete.